we are back at it again here with another video with the invest for tomorrow to the first time viewers and investors welcome to the channel to all subscribers welcome back all i ask for in return is for you to smash that like button to let me know you watch this video helps out the youtube channel and lets me know you appreciate the time and effort i put into making these videos so here we are with ada cardano it is consolidating and fighting to stay above two dollars it has been struggling we've talked about how important it is and today i have some information and data to share with you guys you won't want to miss but before we break it all down i want to share with you guys the home run opportunity i mentioned this morning over at the discord and if you trade stocks apart from crypto you may want to check out the link down below in the description to the discord to join us and get in on early on opportunities that we look for every single day and every single week and we're going to jump right into it here with ada cardano so today's home run was spectacular and beyond expectations it all happened in a matter of minutes and if you want to get in on early on opportunities like these we strive for them every single day even though it's a friday and it turned out to be a little tricky the opportunities are there and you can become part of a growing community of investors all looking to learn and grow together we look for opportunities every single day these are the stocks i mentioned this morning every single one gave us opportunities of five to ten percent ten to twenty percent within their drops and runs up but the home run of the day was gfai let's go ahead and look at this chart together so you could see here how quickly this all unraveled so in the pre-market i was watching as it was picking up and consolidating here towards the bell and right at the bell it took off in a matter of 10 minutes to a highest point of 25 percent plus pulled back down and went up for another five to ten percent right after that pullback after hitting that highest point dropped pretty fast the volatility was wild and in a matter of two minutes from that point down here all the way back up to this peak it went up another 20 percent and then it gave a third opportunity of five to fifteen percent so if you would like to become part of this and get in on early with us check out the link down below in the description to the discord we look forward to having you join us let's jump into these charts so here we are with cardano ada and it's actually holding up like i stated earlier in the video and this is super important to be watching because if it holds up above 190 or even down here at these areas of almost 189 it's going to be important to watch between that area and two dollars we really want to see this hold up above two dollars and it is fighting as we could see here by a thin hair right on thin ice sitting around this area there's some important things though that make this the future blockchain of the future right or at least have a chance to compete with ethereum when it comes to the market share of what they do and what they provide right on the blockchain networks and so forth so ada had fallen really fast all the way down here to 172 i stated in previous videos it wasn't the only one we saw ethereum do the same thing and we also saw bitcoin do the same thing i explained how bitcoin indirectly affects ethereum and ethereum indirectly affects obviously cardano and ada in general not only that one it affects others as well but for the most part it affected ada but as you could see ethereum and bitcoin have made their moves they have not paused or waited just like what's been going on with ada kind of just sitting there sideways this was the quickest move but at least we saw some strength after this flash crash on that date 172 was not the low and it didn't stay down there if not it jumped back up to the 190s it fought towards 205 and it's been fighting to stay above two dollars so these are very pivotal moments right now for ada cardano itself moving forward and if there's going to be true strength because there are some key levels that we've talked about before that this needs to break through to go ahead and reach newer highs and the most important resistance level right now is 245 right up here at this level then we have 280 and then we would have to reconsider and talk about 310 and if it breaks through 310 how it does between that area and 350 and then towards 
those price targets that are mind-blowing of four dollars five dollars and even to ten dollars before the end of the year and some of them are stating in the next six months to a year those are some mind-blowing numbers but before getting to any of those four dollars is the first level that needs to be touched to then reanalyze and see what the other analysis ratings are saying but before even getting there 245 is the first step to get anywhere to the upside and build some strength now in the 30 minute when we zoom in here we could see there's been a lot of fighting here and it's trying to do its best to stay up the worst that can happen is go towards 190 bounce back up and try to hold itself up if this is actually showing some type of strength but if there's real weakness in this and it breaks through 190 significantly then we have to watch how it does between 190 172 and how things continue to play out as we see it in the chart so when we come over here we could see in the trending list it is not even on the list okay it was cardano number 27 28 no longer here when we go to most visited it is also not on the list so you go through the list it is not here this right here is also a sign that things are slowing down right now for cardano there's a lot of attention on others in the crypto space and altcoins but let's go ahead and talk about cardano itself and some of the things that is going on with setting record highs for cardano ada it says here volume of ada staked on cardano network reaches record high this is huge because cardano holds bragging rights for the network with the highest proportion of its circulating supply staked and that right there goes ahead and makes a huge statement for the cardano's community okay staking is a huge portion of growth of some of these altcoins meme coins joke coins or whatever it is that you want to consider them and cardano is actually trying to have or serve a real purpose when it comes to energy consumption on what blockchains do right this means that the most investors have their coins staked on the platform to serve as validators on its proof of stake mechanism total ada stake hits 73 percent of supply guys this is huge it states here as well that this move seems to have paid off as cardano saw a record number of total circulating supply hit an all-time high this week this right here is stating a lot about cardano's community cardano's holders ada holders and what it could mean for the future now this is an article that i really liked and it breaks down right how ethereum right they put it into the whole entire spectrum here and this is how they indirectly correlate because they're talked about always in different articles ethereum and cardano offer a chance to own the future basically saying these both can have a future of growth flipping effects and also bring each other up or compete in the staking of the blockchain market share and investors or either or people could be buying both right or more of one and more of the other but this is huge because cardano's weak price action over the past week and even the past weeks and months its new partnerships are garnering renewed interest okay so we may not be seeing right now the growth and potential of cardano but it's been doing a huge amount of partnerships and growth and expansion that we could see in the future i'm not saying that it can't stop it from going lower right based off technicals you know just volume a lot of outflow uncertainty doubt people just cashing out because remember ada did not come from a dollar 50 cents it came from all the way down at seven and ten cents all the way up to three dollars i mean some type of profit taking was bound to happen along the way but this could be a small blimp on the road or in the story that is going to unravel for cardano in the years to come and it says here by offering cardano and ethereum we are giving our customers the tools to successfully build with blockchain and accept crypto payments at a scale and own the future okay cardano this is the main goal right in context of their utility says a faster and cheaper validation of transactions 
Ethereum is the number two blockchain behind Bitcoin. Cardano, in this case, is trying to be third or take Ethereum's place, making it faster, more efficient, and cheaper, guys. This is not just a coin that is a joke. You know, even though it's an altcoin, it is something that has the possibilities of growth and expansion. I look forward to seeing your thoughts down below. How you feel about ADA? Do you think it's going to break 190 and go towards 170 again? Or is it going to fight, consolidate, and get back up over two and keep on pushing towards 245 and continuation of those price targets to the upside? Do you think those price targets are possible because they are just mind blowing? Do you think it's going to miss it or could it happen someday in the future? At least 245, go back to three and reach $4. As always, guys, thank you guys so much for watching and let's make some money.